It is not officially winter, but one area wintertime attraction is getting a jump on the fun. Peak and Peak Ski Resort opened today, and they also let us know about some of the new additions this season. Brian Wilk joins us in the studio with more tonight. Brian. Hey Jennifer, I even had a chance to speak with the very first person who went down the slopes for the season. The ski resort in New York is opening skiing earlier than they have in the past few years. Officials tell us they put a lot of time and money into renovating the property since last ski season. They bought two more groomers, snowmaking upgrades, and the rental shop has been completely renovated. They're looking forward to a great season a few weeks earlier than last season started. And then just the weather. I mean, last year it was a warm warm through this time of year. We were open just before Christmas last year, so we've got a, a few week jump on uh, last year's ski season. And that makes great news for business and families eager to hit the slopes early. We get so many families and to see them come out early um, this far ahead of Christmas is, is just really encouraging because uh, like I said it's, it's been a few years since we had that opportunity. Jim Kaflish was among the first people to ride down the slopes this season. He's been coming to Peak and Peak for 58 years. His father was one of the original founders. People love to ski here. It's a great place to learn to ski and uh, there's always good snow and uh, good atmosphere. What makes the first day on the slopes so special? Well, the uh, change of season, the snow, getting in the Christmas spirit and just getting out and having some recreation. Peak and Peak will be open through this weekend. They'll be closed next week, but open good for next Friday. Uh, Jennifer? All right, Brian, thank you.